Hey guys, three brand new crates were just leaked for Toilet Tower Defense, and if you haven't seen them yet, in this video, I'm going to show you how I discovered this. So the one, I think, is actually going to be an April Fool's crate, which is pretty cool. But before we get into that, guys, if you're new around here, make sure you check out my website, ltcrazy.com. This is the best value website out there, guys. I pretty much update it almost every day as well. And to find your values, just go down to the Toilet Tower Defense page right here, and you can either use the search bar, search up whatever unit you're looking for, or just click through the tabs here and find whatever you're looking for that way. And if you guys are on my website and you're new around here, make sure you check out the giveaway page because we're doing some awesome giveaways for you guys. So all you got to do to enter is make sure you subscribe to this channel. Make sure you guys, you know, of course, leave a like on the video. It just helps out a ton. And make sure you comment your Roblox username. Once you do those three things, you're pretty much good to go. Just make sure you type in your email, your Roblox name in here. Enter, you know, these three things after you did them. And I'll double check to make sure you did. And once you're confirmed, you'll be good to go. And then in the next, like video or so when we hit 470k we're gonna pick the winners so thank you guys for helping support the channel wrote this you know 470k let's get there boys thank you so much for your support let's get back to the video though and let me show you how i found these crazy crates so you know this mode that i got here because i'm like a you know partner on this game it's like the the no quit mode or kind of like free cam mode this is actually how i discovered it so i was like flying around the map right and in the normal area, if you guys remember way back, I actually discovered there's like a 100 player lobby down there in that like cube box, right? But then I was looking all around again, and there's really nothing else. So what I actually did is I went to other places. I went to the trading plaza, and you're not going to believe what I found in there. You guys probably could believe it because you saw it in the start of the video. But let me show you in real time when I actually discovered it. It's actually pretty cool, guys. So let me go show you what these three crates are actually looking like and where they were located. What the heck is this? Look at that, guys. Wait, look at this. The uh, the main lobby is like legit right here, I think, right? What is all this out here? Let's go take a look. I don't know what this is all about. Wait, what the heck? What's going on out here? What is this? Wait, let's see. Let's see. Hold up here. Let's see. Let's see. Let me look. Let me look. It looks like maybe it's a bunch of spawns, potentially. I don't, I don't know. We're Yeah, we're getting closer. What the heck is this thing? Yo, wait, wait, wait. Hold up here. What is this? Um, guys, what is that? What is that? What is that? Yo, I don't know. New crates. That's awesome, guys. There's new crates coming to the game pretty soon. All right, guys. So now you saw all the three of the crates. Let's talk about each one, you know, one by one here. So the one all the way to the left. This one was like the blue one, right? Now, the blue one, I'm going to be honest with you. It's kind of like blue and white. It has a little like camera on the top. I have a feeling. I don't know why, but I feel like that's some sort of remake. And, you know, this once again, this is just leaks. And I don't know if this is true or not. This was obviously not supposed to be found because it's actually not in the game anymore. I just looked today and it's not there, which is pretty suspicious, right? But it kind of gives me vibes of just like an exclusive scientist crate. Maybe they're going to bring back like an overpowered engineer or something like that to the game. Because think about it, guys. Think about this. We haven't had a spawnering unit in a long, 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 long time. Think about it. When was the last good unit that was a spawner? There, there is none. Engineer sucks. And the camera helicopter, you know, it used to be good, but it sucks too now. There's no point of ever using either one of these units. But imagine they bring this new crate back. It's like an enhanced exclusive scientist crate, right? And it has really good engineers, really good scientists, like a better farm unit than the Santa TV. And then maybe even a, like a new healer type unit like the large scientist cameraman was. What if, guys? What if? Now, come on. Tell me that's not cool. I think that's pretty awesome. And it would be a good addition. Get rid of the hyper crate. Bring this thing back. All right. Now, that's one of the crates done, right? So we obviously right now in this game, we have two crates that are currently existing. So that means we have room for another one. And that other one is, of course this one that you guys see here as well the orange crate with the little blue and stuff and a little yellow as well but it's also got a camera on top so this one i'm honestly like 100 percent guys i'm gonna be 100 percent real with you i have no idea this one could be literally anything my guess is maybe it's a crate that has like some sort of you know, do you know how there's like two universes in this thing? Like how there's like the fan made one that has like the Titan Clock Man and Titan Drill Man and stuff. Maybe it contains units from like a different type of universe, but that's just a complete guess and I have no idea. But because like that one just, you know, it doesn't really look like anything. So I don't have a clue. It could be like a, you know, rehanced, you know, maybe, I don't know, like a mix up of spiders or some other stuff, but it just doesn't look like a spider crate. If anything, 
kind of looks like the turkey crate or the scary crate but that doesn't make any sense either because it's not that part of like you know the event so to be honest with you with that one guys i don't really know but just expect something new like three new units from that crate as well now the interesting one here though is by far by far boys the jester crate all right that's clearly some sort of jester hat some sort of jokeries going on right and what's april fools all about jokes right when's april fools it's literally tomorrow or if whenever you're watching this video potentially today so guys you might all be surprised with this brand new crate today it's blue it's got a jester hat and who the heck knows what it's gonna have in it probably some sort of jester type unit right that would only make sense or it's just gonna be some sort of big prank which i'm assuming you know toilet tower defense is one of the biggest games out there right now most big games they do cool events during every type of thing that could have an event in it and you know april fools always has an event in like pet sim and stuff like that so i'm guessing talantric you know he was a big player of pet sim he knows about that and i think he's gonna do it in one in this game as well but we're just gonna have to see guys i really think that this crate right here is really you know showing us that there is some sort of you know jester april fools type you know thing coming to the game so expect some sort of big joke tomorrow right who the heck knows maybe it'll be like infinite units and you use like as many units as you want tomorrow who knows just expect something big and uh yeah i hope that you guys are all excited for that so if you enjoyed seeing these cool leaks you know you guys won't see this anywhere else make sure you guys smash that subscribe button leave a like and let me know in the comments what you think about these three crates and what you think the three of them might mean or what they might be or anything like that guys i'm curious i love reading your comments i love seeing what y'all have to say so please feel free to let me know but yeah that's kind of my opinions on these but what do you guys say now that we got through all those crates we go ahead and we do some sort of challenge now there's lots of different challenges we could do but there was a brand new unit released yesterday right the mech what do you guys say we do some sort of mech challenge guys i can only use mech units mech one mech two mech three and then we'll toss on the santa tv just like this and we'll toss on a dj tv man and what do you say we go from there we jump into a match and we see how far we could get for this game let's try out the toilet city and i'll meet you guys on in there all right guys we just loaded in here to the beautiful toilet city let's vote for nightmare mode because you know you guys don't know it but i just played a whole match and i got to wave 20 and i realized i was playing easy mode so i felt like an idiot but here we are now we're gonna do nightmare mode this time no wonder why i won so easily i was kind of like shocked at first i was like what the heck i'm actually doing really good right now and then i realized i was like oh wait a second i'm on easy mode i, I seriously i was playing i got to like wave like eight and ten i was like why is there no bosses right now and then it kind of hit me and i was like well i might as well finish it out and get the win so i did but here we go we're gonna do the real challenge now nightmare mechs only of course i got a dj and a santa i really really wish i had some sort of medic like a speaker and a paradrone or just the medic in general because without him i mean it's gonna be a bit scary boys i'm not gonna lie it's gonna be a bit scary we might run into some big issues here but you know it is what it is there's not much i could really do about it right now now i would really really hate to have all of these enemies come through and hit us here so i might actually drop down a mech guys i know that sounds crazy you know normally i probably wouldn't do something like that but in this case i feel like it's kind of a good idea to just drop them down and see what the heck happens so let's just get them like right there in that corner that way none of those guys could attack us and it just saves us a little bit of trouble now hopefully they don't all get by but they are moving kind of quick a lot quicker than when i was playing easy mode let me tell you a lot quicker when i was playing easy mode all right but it is what it is we got them down now now we are going to still have some issues here we got to upgrade him again because if i don't then he is just not going to be able to get all of these guys and we're going to die so we cannot afford to die on wave five of this sort of challenge because that would be extremely embarrassing and would just go to show how bad the mechs are and we we don't want to do the mechs dirty like that guys i want to show the mechs as being like a really really good unit so let's go ahead drop down another mech right here and yeah look at that there comes a boss now boys now it's gonna be a little bit harder i was seriously so confused last game i i was like i'm doing great right now what the heck why do people hate on the mechs but then now i'm starting to realize why people hate on the mechs because it is extremely difficult to survive but just using mechs guys i'm not even kidding they're just not it boys he's not it all right simple as that he's just not the unit that you want to be using i don't know what to say i mean he doesn't attack quick enough every one second is just unfortunately not enough 
I mean, we might survive this. Don't get me wrong now. Don't get me wrong, guys. But it's not going to be pretty. However, I'm going to give it everything I got. All right? We could try a different strategy. We could try it one more time if we fail here. Because, I mean, we are almost dead. So, as of right now, things are definitely not looking good for the boys here on this one. All right? But the game's not over yet. So, let's not give up quite yet. It's almost over. Don't get me wrong. But, see, that's the thing. It's not over not over just yet but i mean man is it not looking good here guys it is not looking good at all so let's kind of just keep on doing what we're doing we obviously cannot like rely on this like og mech here i don't think he just he doesn't do enough for us guys i mean maybe if i get enough points right here right now and i can upgrade this guy i might be okay however he did just get stunned so that's horrible I really need to upgrade him. There we go. He is upgraded now, so that's actually big. We could maybe survive slightly longer and maybe long enough to get down this big bad man right here. And if I get him down, guys, there might be a little bit of hope. All right? Maybe a little bit. Maybe not much, but a little bit. All right? So let me try to get him down. Or do I go for the upgrade on the mech? I got to go for the upgrade on the mech, right? Because if I don't, I'm going to die. I think I just made the play of the game right there by canceling that and changing my mind, guys. Let's get down a nice little DJ TV man there. And then we'll go from there. That guy is going to be a problem. That little buzz saw. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this guy here. And I don't have enough money to play. Oh, it's cost 400. Oops. Well, let's get him down now. And he's just going to be bait for the buzz saw. That's simply what he's going to be used for, guys. Nothing. Literally nothing else. Because... It's going to be good bait. Trust me. It's going to actually help out quite a bit, I think. And it might actually carry us pretty darn far. So let's go ahead, though. Maybe we'll get down. I think again, this like upgraded Mech Titan guy down like right there. And he is going to help out quite a bit by just doing, you know, a decent amount of damage there. It's not too good, but it's better than nothing. So we'll get him down, upgrade to Santa. I mean, all these other guys, they don't seem like too much of an issue for me. I think that will be fine here. I mean, on the track right now, there is a lot of enemies. Don't get me wrong, but... Is it going to kill us? I don't know. Maybe. It might. I hope not, but we'll see. We'll see here. These mutant toilets are getting kind of far, though. That's not a good sign. Just uh, looking at that. I mean, that's that's terrible, guys. That's terrible. That's a terrible start. Let's upgrade our Santa, though, because I really could use a lot of money here, and I'm just not getting money quick enough because my starter units just aren't good enough to hold the line down. So that kind of sucks, but, you know, it's the world we live in here, so it's what we got to deal with. But I did just get my upgraded mech upgraded, so that's good. And, you know, maybe that'll help us survive a little teeny tiny bit longer. So let's kind of just hope that that's the case. And, you know, oh, man, I got the mech down for no reason. Or sorry, not the mech, but the upgraded DJ guy here. He doesn't affect these guys at all. So, well, that's not good. That's kind of useless. Maybe, though, maybe if I get this guy down here at some point, boys, like right here, I'm not even kidding. Maybe we'll just be okay, right? However, that guy is coming in hot and we aren't killing him um we are not okay <laughs> we are not okay i repeat we are not okay all right boys well that did not go again let's play again let's just try a little bit of a different starting strategy all right because well hey let's be honest that didn't work at all that sucked so i just don't think that that like starting mech is worth your time anymore unfortunately he used to be because he used to slow well he still does he slows enemies down so you know what i take back what i just said legit i take back what i said you can place him down later on and he'll slow the enemies down but at the start of the game i think it's best if you just go straight for farm units get the 600 dollars and place down your op units because if you don't do that i mean you're gonna die so we gotta get the upgraded mech cameraman down right away I think that that's going to be the difference maker here. And I could put him down like right here. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be a pretty OP spot for him. For the time being. I mean, I could get him down there as well. But that won't be as good because there's going to be so many guys coming along the track. I've always will, you know, most likely get enough money to place down more as we go further and further along. But to start the match out, definitely just getting these guys down is going to be ginormous for surviving. Hopefully a long time. Now we are going to get attacked here unfortunately guys there's nothing that i could do about this these boys here i mean just have the toilet city all right just take it but everyone else i gotta take them out or we die and lose 
So that's my goal here. I'm going to try to make sure I clutch up. I still don't think I'm going to have enough money to... Yeah, I still don't have enough money, guys. So I need to get this next wave to skip before those dudes get all the way around to here. If they do, I die and lose. I lose it all. If they, you know, don't, then I might still have a chance. But you got to keep in mind, this dude only attacks every one second, too. So that's not quite good. You know, I need to get him upgraded ASAP. Otherwise, once again, I die <laughs> and I lose everything. So... You know, this strategy may, in fact, not work. I mean, he's not doing too bad. I mean, he's he's kind of killing them. I mean, how much HP? I have 250 HP left. So even if he doesn't get all of them, as long as he gets a few, then I'm going to be just all right. Now, he really, really needs to go ham here and take out these guys quick. If not, I'm going to die. So let's go there, buddy. You got to get those guys and you got to get them quicker than that, man. Because right now, buddy, we're in a lot of trouble. I don't know if... Uh, you realize that or not dude but you're not getting the job done here buddy you're just not he's not doing it guys i really need to get that dude down right there and hope that i could uh survive a little bit longer here because that you know getting him down at the start was not the move i guess i thought it potentially was gonna be the move here but sadly i was mistaken and he just is not good enough hopefully this one could stay alive and clutch up for us it looks like he could so i mean we might get hit a little bit oh goodness guys oh goodness this is bad this is really really bad i gotta get down a second one i don't want to do it but i have to or otherwise i'm seriously gonna die let's put it on last and no i'm guys I mean, maybe i don't die here maybe i don't die it's gonna be close it is legit gonna be super duper close i need oh my god guys i have 10 hp left i thought it was game over it's not game over yet all right don't sleep on your boy just quite yet let's go ahead we're gonna get this guy upgraded as soon as it skips the waves here and we're gonna be attacking every 0.5 seconds and life may just be slightly different for us so let's get this guy down here the dj and that should help us out a lot he's going ham now let him cook guys let him cook here look at him go all right all right all right there you go come on smack him there you go yep 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 come on keep going keep going there bud Let's go. You got this. 100%. Easy, bro. This is, this is easy work. This is a piece of cake. This is a piece of cake, guys, right here. Let's go. He's got this under control. Oh, yeah, he does. I'll die every day. No, he's sleeping. He doesn't have it under control. No, he's actually affected like that that easily. Guys, come on. That stinks. That stinks. Why do they make the new mythic? Come on. You should be more resistant than that. You just sat there and, you know, you let him do that to you. What the heck, bro? All right, well, I guess that's not going to work out for us. So let's go ahead and upgrade this guy here. Because if I don't, I mean, we can't get hit once or we die. So, yeah, I got to upgrade. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get him. Get him. Come on. Get him. Get him. It's so close. Oh, man. I thought we got him there. I thought we survived it. No. All right. Well, hey, you win some and you lose some sometimes. The mech only challenge cannot be done because they just are not good enough i hate to break it to you guys you need a starter unit sadly so make sure you know that if you ever you know just you want to get those units and use them fortunately if you're a fan of the mechs they're not good enough and even though they just added a brand new one he's just not good enough guys he, he's too expensive to get the job done for you so i always uh recommend still the best starter unit is obviously the one from the starter pack right here green laser cameraman i mean He's just simple, good, and effective. So use him, and you'll be fine in the start. I mean, you can always switch him out for one of those units and maybe be okay, but I like to go with that kind of squad. I feel like that's the most fair. Give all the mechs a chance and see what you can do. But boys, listen, before we wrap up this video, if you're still watching, thank you guys so much for the support. I appreciate you. Help your boy out. Leave a like, subscribe if you're not already, and make sure you guys drop a comment. Thank you so much. It helped me out a ton. But let's go ahead and check out the mailbox. And remember, guys, I, you know, these mailboxes, like when I open them up, any gifts you guys send me, remember, boys, I really don't give those back because, once again, I warn you in all my videos, please only send me gifts that you do not want anymore, or, you know, you just want me to have. I don't sign units from the post office. If you ever want to sign a unit for me, boys, come to my streams, all right? I always sign in my streams. I might even be streaming tonight after this video comes out. So, stay tuned for that, all right? Stay tuned for that. Let's go ahead and uh check what we got so 70 units in here thank you guys so much for these i appreciate you ninja thank you maryland maryland gg 
Zan, Jackson, CJ, CJ, Rayun, CJ, 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 Ouya, 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 CJ, CJ, CJ. Yo, CJ sends me so much stuff. CJ, you're a W, bro. Thank you to everyone so far, though. You guys are crazy. CJ, buddy, how much does this guy have? Guys, I mean, look at this. CJ with a shotgun. Neo, thank you. G set, thank you. Jax, thank you for the healer. Holy smokes. And a UCS. Let's go. Kiwi, thank you for that. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. Oh, you sent me a couple things. Nim, thank you. Gummy, thank you. Nye, thank you. Gummy. Nye. La. Couch. Country. Ayan. Mr. Die. Hello. Hello. BD. Nebula. Nebula again. Thank you, buddy. Aiden. Slaughter. Ape. We got Ricky. Koi. Dash. 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 Dino. Ha. Rudy. Core. Supreme. Supreme again. All day. Just. And we got Isaac down here at the bottom. Thank you guys so much, boys. I appreciate the 70 gifts. Remember, if you do want to send me something, my real username is in the description of this video. But by no means do you have to. And, you know, only if you want to, guys. And remember, if you send me something in the mailbox, I will keep it, okay? Because, you know, I do warn you every single video. It's also in the description of my thing. So if you're looking for my name, you literally see it in there. And also, the game warns you too. Any gifts, they are gifts. You will not receive your unit slash gems back, all right? So... You know, don't expect me to sign because I literally warned you that I'm saying I'm not going to sign. So there should be no reason for you to expect me to sign it because I just will not from there. Okay. I love signing units, guys, but I just physically don't want to go through that all day, all day long. And, you know, sometimes people send it to the wrong LT crazy account and then they think I'm a bad guy just that way. So this is why I just have a strict no signing policy. All right. That way it's only you to blame. But anyways, let's go to the trading files and see if we can make any good deals. All right. Let's go see. Let's go see if we can make some good deals in the trading plaza because I'm feeling lucky right now. I want to get to 200,000 coins for gems. That would be awesome. And it would just, you know, make me pretty happy about it. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I would love to get to that because I personally think it would be amazing to have 200,000 gems. Like, imagine that, guys. That would just feel pretty darn good if you ask me. So that's my goal. I'm going to see if I could do it. Will I be able to? I'm not too sure, guys, but... Listen, I'm going to try my best, all right? So let me cook here, let me do my job, and let me see what I can make happen for us. Now, these Titan present mans are going for 450 in there. Do y'all think I could sell some of those? I don't, I don't really think I need those. I wonder if I have any units right now that are not signed. Let me go double check here. So non-signed, if you go like that and type, like, pretty much that in exactly, it'll pop up all your non-signed... Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Guys, I have a lot of non-signed units. Let me delete, like, all of these camera women because they're all pretty trash. Am I right? We don't really need those. Guys, you want to know what's crazy, though? Let's see here. I wonder how much we're going to get back for all of this. I bet it's not going to be a lot. I bet we're going to only get, like, 1,000 coins back. Isn't that crazy? Don't you think you should get a lot more? I mean, maybe not because, like... They are kind of junk units, but like, I wonder how much we're actually going to get back. I, I just have a feeling it's not going to be a lot at all. Let's keep those. And that way, you know, I could just, just like give them to people. If, if any of you guys look at that, I was right. A thousand for 95 units. I'm, I can't believe I was right about that. That's crazy. But yeah, listen, guys, if any of y'all need some of these, uh, you know, units that you see here, I got a bunch of extras. Just let me know your username in the comments and which one you might need. And I might pick like one of you two, you guys, you know, even outside the giveaway and just kind of give you guys some of these just to help me clear up my inventory a little bit and make room for some bigger and better items. So just let me know. Obviously, guys, like I can't give you like a hyper or anything. So, you know, don't be greedy. If you need like a, a starter unit or something like that, please let me know. If you're new to this game, I got you. I'll help you uh, get a little bit better. All right. But uh, don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. I'm not giving you a hyper. I literally don't have you know, more than like two or three hypers or, you know, whatever. I'm not sure how many I have right now, but I know it's not a lot. But anyways, look at these guys. I got three healers. I know my boy Jax. Shout out to Jax. He's been uh, the top tip in my last couple streams. He's an absolute legend. He sent me a healer in the mailbox. So that was a big W from him. And, you know, maybe we could use that in one of my future videos because they're a pretty good unit. Have you guys ever tried that one out if you got it? I'm not sure, you know, if you guys were lucky enough to pull it or not, but man the healer is actually kind of fire like it's not a bad unit whatsoever it gets the job done and it's just you know really really good so if you haven't used it i recommend giving it a shot because i really really do think you will like it but you got to understand 
you can only place down two so you're definitely going to want to have some other sort of like dps unit in your kit otherwise you are probably going to die unfortunately i hate to break it to you but yeah if you don't have too many good units you're going to die and that's going to be the end of you so if you want to avoid that take my word and you know probably equip some other stuff all right otherwise you will die but boys i have a lot i just realized of like saw units i don't know how i get so many saw units but man i think it's all from my boy cj i'm not even kidding cj dude you sent me so many saws man let me know in the comments of this video have you got the hyper yet buddy i guys someone hooked my boy up with the hyper he sent me so many things he must open up these like you know blue crates non-stop every single day trying to get this hyper and man do i hope he got it by now because dude had to spend over a thousand dollars on this game i'm not even kidding buddy is filling talantric's pockets with just cash you are lying in his pockets with cash buddy you are crazy for it man but yeah i mean we got all the saws pretty much signed up now so that's a w those are really really good to sell in the uh, marketplace they seem to get bought up pretty darn quick you know maybe not the quickest item that you could sell but they're definitely not too bad i definitely have to go through though and get all these crates good to go because i have too many crates and i mean these like djs and stuff usually i'd go through those but i don't think that they're going to be too important right now and also guys i just realized i have two thousand out of two thousand so yeah we need to start selling guys we need to start selling and maybe we even sell for like cheaper than you know what you might think i would sell for like let's just get rid of some of these units for some of the boys here in the server so 70 i mean i'll go 99 on these things and i think that that's a pretty darn good deal so 99 we'll do that i'll buy that 71 in a minute and if we could sell like 25 of these guys i mean that's good 25 saws gone like right out of there and i mean then i guess i i suppose i could do some toxics maybe for like 200 and then there's obviously some other stuff I could sell as well. Like, I have a bunch of crates and whatnot. Now, the crates are, are a tough one, guys. Because, you know, for me, you know, owning my, like, value website and stuff, I know crates, they're going to go up in value. So, I find it very hard to sell those when I know that if I wait, like, a month or two, they're going to rise in value. So, to be honest, I might actually hold on to my crates, especially all these last couple of events happening. You know, if you guys sold your Leprechaun crates, boys, they're going to be going up. Hold on to them. They might reach like 200 at some point. I mean, you know, at some point they were like 50, but like they might go up to like 200. I kid y'all not. So definitely, definitely hold on and just give it a little bit. All right. Wait a good month. Wait till the end of summer. Sell it then. And I'm telling you, you'll thank me later. But boys, now we just listed all those, right? I need to start selling some because I have no room. Guys, let's see here. Guys, buy my, let's see, signed, signed saws super cheap all right go get them boys go get them hopefully some people scoop them up i don't know if this is a you know pretty loaded server or not it looks like a lot of people actually don't really have too many gems so i'll see if they do it or not there we go we got one guy to buy it so that's nice now i would like i said i would love to get rid of these other ones in here like this one that's going for 70 looks like there's three going oh people are buying them like crazy now guys yo that's what we want so like we sold a good seven so far let's just keep listing some more here and trying to get rid of them all because like i said i don't you know i like this saw don't get me wrong by no means is it a bad unit but man it's filling up my inventory right now and i think that if we just get rid of a bunch of them number one it'll make a bunch of fans in the server happy because my signs you know not many people have my signs and number two I think it'll just, you know, help us clear up our inventory. Number three, you know, we'll get a little bit of gems for it. So and then we'll put those gems towards getting better units that we could use for, you know, cooler giveaways and stuff like that in the future. So I think that's a W all around, right? But yeah, we almost sold all of these things. So at least maybe not all of them, but most of them are in the trading plaza now. So people are buying them, then uh, we'll get rid of them. So there we go. We got this one right here for 70, that one for 70 as well, and this one for 70. So now mine are going to be the top one so yeah people are gonna start scooping them up like crazy i hope that's the plan at least so here we go there's still more being bought down to 21 let's just keep going guys i gotta make sure i don't actually sell like a toxic for 99 because they're definitely worth a little bit more than that right but i could definitely get rid of a few more i think because at this rate 
I'm gonna have endless. <laughs> Seriously, I have too many, guys. Too many. Thank you for anyone who helped, you know, buy some of these and and whatnot. You guys are W's for that. All right. So we're now up to 184,000. That is pretty darn awesome. That's good. That's really good, honestly. Yo, my show's in the game right now. Shout out to my show. Let me go check him out real quick. This is uh, my show. I'm sure you guys have seen him before. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm not sure, but shout out to my show. What's up, man? Hopefully this guy is, is doing good. What's up, dude? Just say hi to him because he's a big supporter. So I appreciate you, my show. But uh, yeah. All right. Let me get out of there. This other guy, Cat, wants to be in a video. Cat apparently was the one that bought a lot of my stuff. His name is God. Cat, your trades are off. Cat, trades are off, bro. So I can't trade them. But it looks like the hype kind of fizzled out a little bit. A lot of them are, are not uh, for sale anymore. So, yo, boys, let's see here. Still got more signed saws for sale. Scoop them up quick while they last. All right, 21 remaining. So there's not many left, guys. Not many left. Diamond's getting a few. Good stuff, my boy. Good stuff. All right, here's God, though. I'm going to say... Hi, God. Thank you for buying, bud. Appreciate that. W. W to uh, Caddy here, all right? Appreciate you, bro. Your W. All right, cool. Let's go back in here. So we got 20 in there now. And I suppose we could sell a few more items. But what? What else should I sell, guys? Should I sell some of these for like 49, maybe? 69? I'll do a flat 50 for these. Flat 50 rate for announcers? Heck yeah. People are going to love these. They're going to scoop them up left and right. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Announcer, announcer, announcer. 22. These are probably worth like about 50, but like signed, they could probably sell them for like 100 in the future. So these guys could probably make profit on these. So honestly, like, hey, if it helps boost their economy, that's good for them, right? And once again, it just clears up my inventory a little bit so people can make a little bit of gems. And I win, they win, you know, everyone wins. And I can use these gems for more giveaways. So you guys watching this video, y'all win as well. So it's a W for everyone involved. So that's what we like to do. And I got a bunch of these things and people seem to be loving these right now. So I'm going to sell all of them. Not well, not all of them. You know what I mean? I'm just going to sell as, as many as I could here because I got quite a bit right now. And I don't... Oh, I'm at 25. Never mind. That's it for me. I'm out of selling a room now. Out of selling capacity. So 185,000 gems. Pretty darn good, guys. I would say that... What? We made like a couple thousand in this video? I mean, hey, if I do that every video in like a thousand videos, I'll have one million gems. And that, my friends, would be pretty awesome. So, wish me luck on my road to 1 million gems. If you guys want to see, like, trading videos, let me know. I could just strictly do, like, trading videos. That would probably be pretty cool. Let me know if that's something y'all are interested. Because I know on YouTube, they seem to do pretty well on other people's, like, videos and stuff. So, maybe I got to start doing trading videos. Maybe you guys like that. Like, I could do, like, some sort of trading video style where, like, every time I do a trade... I could show like the win and loss of it. And then like at the end of the video, I'll show how much I made in total. That might be kind of fire. Let me know what y'all think about that. All right. And maybe I could get that rolling for you guys. But uh, hey, that's it for this video. Once again, guys, if you made it this far in the video, you're absolute W's best people in the world. Thank you guys for supporting me and what I do here. If you guys have not done so already, make sure you subscribe, comment and like the video just to, you know, help push it out in the algorithm. And that does, you know, of course, help me out and you know, definitely keeps me motivated. So thank you guys so much. I appreciate you for that. And if you want to watch another epic video of mine, make sure you check out the one on my screen right now. And don't forget, if you're a big trader, use my website, ltcrazy.com to get all the values you will ever need. And so that way you never get scammed again. It's the values I use every day when I trade. So good luck, guys. And I hope it helps you out. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Adios.